All right, quick and easy. Here is a quick review of the Autobot Blaster G1 version reissue from Walmart. He is a little browner than the original. Uh, the, the gray, this is more of a lighter gray, and now he's kind of more of a brownish color. You see, he's very basic, um, and I do want to say thank you to Shane. He even has a 1984 uh, stamp on the back. But uh, thank you to Shane for, from Twitter for uh, picking one of, the, one of these up for me. They're cheap at Walmart. A lot of Walmarts put them on clearance for like, two to four dollars depending on where your uh what your walmart was doing so they were they were cheap blasters he comes with he's very basic you get blaster and his gun you get no tapes you get no extras uh, you get a crooked autobot symbol on mine but that's like again that's a minor concern it was mostly just a it was cheap and i had an old blaster toy and why not but yeah he's a boom box you can push this button and his little cassette holder pops open looks like he may hold two tapes in there does he maybe he does um but yeah, no cassettes, um, but uh, he does have the tape deck. You don't get steel jaw or rewind or eject or iron horn, ram horn. Is it ram horn? Yeah. Anyway, he's a boombox. Counterpart to Soundwave, has his own little tape dudes, looks out and shouts. Um, some older detail speakers, a little on-off switch, some stickers. He does have a heat rub Autobot symbol right there on what will become his crotch. So transform them, we just slide this over and open the legs down and these little panels fold up into the side. So fold them down, collapse his legs, flip down his toes like that. Extend his arms, rotate them out at the shoulder like that, collapse them into the body, flip out his fists and then rotate them forward and then pop up his head, which is now off screen. Go. Swip just enough to see if we can fit up the whole thing in there. Eh. There we go. And then turn his head around. It's flat on the back. And there's Blaster. And then you take his rifle and you throw it across your review series. And then you pick it up and and put it in his hand. And there you go. He's got some swivelly articulation here. He's got he actually has wrist swivel. Not a whole lot of G1 toys did. I guess Prime did because you plugged him in, but you know, not a whole lot of them. Uh, he's got some hippie movements, no front to back here. Just side to side, he can break dance. Anyway, no toes. No, I mean, like his arms move, his head can turn side to side. And that's really about it. He's a big box. But he's Blaster. He was a toy from my childhood. He's fun. He's cool. He's got shiny stickers. And uh, maybe on clearance at Walmart. So again, thank you, Shane, for, for nabbing him for me. He, I'm going to find a place on the shelf for him to stand and be a proud old Autobot boombox and maybe get some tapes for him to put in his chest hole. All right, good night.